Tesla lived at the Waldorf Astoria in New York City from 1900 and ran up a large bill. He moved to the St. Regis Hotel in 1922 and followed a pattern from then on of moving to a different hotel every few years and leaving unpaid bills behind. Tesla walked to the park every day to feed the pigeons. He began feeding them at the window of his hotel room and nursed injured birds back to health. He said that he had been visited by a certain injured white pigeon daily. He spent over $2,000, equivalent to $34,970 in 2022, to care for the bird, including a device he built to support her comfortably while her broken wing and leg healed. Tesla stated, I had been feeding pigeons, thousands of them for years, but there was one, a beautiful bird, pure white with light gray tips on its wings. That one was different. It was a female. I had only to wish and call her and she would come flying to me. I loved that pigeon as a man loves a woman, and she loved me. As long as I had her, there was a purpose to my life. Tesla's unpaid bills, as well as complaints about the mess made by pigeons, led to his eviction from St. Regis in 1923. He was also forced to leave the Hotel Pennsylvania in 1930 and the Hotel Governor Clinton in 1934. At one point, he also took rooms at the Hotel Marguerite. Tesla moved to the Hotel New Yorker in 1934. At this time, Westinghouse Electric and Manufacturing Company began paying him $125, equivalent to $2,730 in 2022 per month, in addition to paying his rent. Accounts of how this came about vary. Several sources claim that Westinghouse was concerned or possibly warned about the potential bad publicity arising from the impoverished conditions in which their former star inventor was living. The payment has been described as being couched as a consulting fee to get around Tesla's aversion to accepting charity. Tesla biographer Mark Seifer described Westinghouse payments as a type of unspecified settlement. In any case, Westinghouse provided the funds for Tesla for the rest of his life.